What about Jesus, the status of Jesus? Isn't he really, I mean, you know, he's the son of God. So God had a son. Hmm. Did he have a daughter? No. So it's just like these two guys, huh? It's kind of chauvinistic, isn't it? How is a woman going to get a fair shake in a religion made up by two guys and a ghost? <laughs> Sorry, but where's the logic in that? Now, if you said that to somebody, you can't get away with it. You can't. This is Malaysia. You talk like that, man, you're an outcast. Where did you come up from? This, this is wrong. Malaysians are not like that. They're innocent, soft people who don't talk like that to each other. But you can give them a CD where I said it. <laughs> and if they say anything, man, that guy was harsh. Yeah, those Texas people. Mm. Yeah, Bush was like that too, wasn't he? <laughs> Don't blame him, man. In fact, you know what? Wouldn't you rather hear it from, I think, from our perspective? We're Malay, we're Asian people. Let's, let's let somebody here talk to us about it. Sunday morning, we've got a class going. Come on, join me over there. You know, we've been together for tea a couple of times now. Let's go over there and we'll do that. That'll be fun. And they give you some free stuff when we leave too. You know, they give you some good... Uh, books and things and some cookies and cool stuff and okay all right boom now you got them set up to come over and meet more Muslims and again when you're meeting non-Muslims don't treat them like they've got a disease <laughs> really I've seen it it's like oh non-Muslim huh okay <laughs> don't touch me <laughs> don't do that they're, they're human beings just like you they don't know yet Allah didn't give them the knowledge. Most of them are pretty innocent. There are a few stinkers out there, okay, that are really bad people who are trying to make trouble. When you find it, then isolate those. Have one brother appointed of your group who will isolate these people. Like we had somebody jump up now and start, ah, 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 ah. so you have a brother who's assigned, and everybody knows this brother, a large brother, maybe like him, who'll go over and he'll say, brother, I'd like to talk to you. That would be my pleasure so much to talk to you now, <laughs> outside. We're going to have a conversation. And if he persists, you can say, I can talk to you with my mouth or we can talk by hand. That would still like outside. And isolate the problem. Because there are a lot of sweet, wonderful people who came to hear a message. And they don't need to see some yo-yo play a game, okay? So you straighten that out in a nice, kind way. And by the way, when you're shaking hands with them, you know, because you go over and put your hand out, shaking hands out, you can start, you know, applying some love to them and let them understand we're not going to put up with that. This is not the place for it. I don't allow the Muslims to do it to the Christians, and I don't allow the Christians to do it to the Muslims. You came here to learn about Islam, we're going to talk about Islam. We're not, going to, we're not going to really make fun of anything. I make jokes, but I make jokes about myself, too. One of the first things I do when I give speeches, I don't know if you notice this, I ask them, can you say my name? My name's Yusuf. They say Yusuf. I say, you got it right the first time, huh? My wife still says useless. <laughs> so I'm not afraid to make fun of myself. That's okay. But I don't want people to hurt other people's feelings. Because if you do that, you're not going to get them. They're not going to listen to you. Plus, Allah's going to be angry with you. Because he told you not to do that. You don't have that right. Nobody has the right to do that. You're talking to a heart, a heart of a human being. Sometimes we use something to kind of jog their thinking. Sometimes we'll use something to make them go, oh, whoa, 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 what's that about? But not to hurt anybody, not to damage them, but to give constructive criticism, perhaps to help them rethink their position.